Hey YouTube, welcome back to Tech Yes, it is brand easy coming back to you guys today with an unboxing and review of the Intel Gigabit CT Desktop Adapter. Now this model number is EXPI9301 BLK. Now the BLK stands for bulk packaging. So if it doesn't have the bulk, if it doesn't have the BLK code on it, it's the retail package which will come with the driver CD and the manual. This is the bulk packaging, so it doesn't come with the driver and the CD. Uh, driver CD and the manual and that's good because it's saving me money I think it's like five dollars cheaper than the retail version, which is great I love it the fact that Intel are doing this I just you know when I buy products nowadays I just want product and this is what Intel is delivering so it's really good now first thing Let's uh, get into the actual box itself. So this is what we get here. Just product open it up you straight away You get the NIC itself now I will say first off that it does have the green PCB I mean this is a pretty outdated stuff. I mean this is like 1990s. I wish Intel would kind of get in with the black PCB theme and make the NIC look really good. That's probably my only thing that I don't like about this NIC. But straight away, let's look at the product. The product itself, it feels really well built. It's sturdy for what it is. It comes with a ATX bracket, standard ATX size bracket there. It also comes with a small form factor bracket if you wish to install this in a smaller uh, case, which is great. I like that. So they're giving you those two things there. Now, in terms of connectivity, this port here is really solid. Your actual LAN cable will go right in there, so it's really good. Uh, fits in and really solid, firm connection there. Now, with the onboard, it's got a lot of circuitry on board. I was actually surprised. It actually is a little bit smaller than I thought it would be. Uh, I think it's about 12 centimeters in length here. And it's overall, I mean, it's just a well-built product. It comes with a lifetime warranty. So for those people who want reliability, this thing will definitely deliver. It's a really good product with the lifetime warranty. So make sure you keep the receipt. Now, this, was, this product is aimed at people who want a reliable desktop NIC. I guess if you're in, you know, if you've got a small business in a server market, um, you got your own server, you want reliable NICs to get those high transfer speeds, this thing will definitely deliver. Now I did test this and the transfer speeds are accurate and they're just uh, consistent basically. That's the way to describe this thing. It delivers consistent speeds at one gigabit per second. It also has the option of auto negotiation. So it can auto negotiate the speeds based on your current connection. If you, you know, if you only need 100 megabits per second, it'll negotiate that. If you only need 10 megabits per second, it will negotiate that. Now it does support these three speeds at full and half duplex, which is great. I like that. Uh, you're probably wondering, well, why, why would I need 10 megabits per second? You would probably need it. I mean, if you are a, if you have your own server and you want to throttle down the connection deliberately, you can do that by just setting 10 megabits per second. So it's a great feature. I like how they're doing, Intel are doing that, which is really good. So I will say moving on now to the drivers itself. The drivers are amazing. This product comes with a full featured driver set. Uh, you can have the option of installing the Intel Pro Set drivers, the advanced drivers, or just the standard drivers. I recommend installing the advanced drivers. It gives you a lot of options to do uh, things like auto negotiation, um, has power saving features, wake on LAN, it has all these uh, power saving features which are really good, they work. Uh, the one thing that I particularly liked about this is the adaptive flow, uh, moderation rate control. Uh, it has a setting called adaptive, so basically if your CPU is on full load, this thing will automatically recognize that and will take the load off the CPU. So it's a great feature. Now for the gamers, uh, people who are wondering, oh, should I get an NIC for gaming? I can, if you have the money, I do recommend it as I did put this up against the killer onboard NIC. And I thought that this, um, especially in games like Black Ops 2, I thought, uh, you know, every bullet was registering with this NIC. I thought it was a great NIC. I had no doubts, you know, whenever I was firing in Black Ops 2, I was like, yeah, every bullet's hidden. This is awesome. So I will say that I thought this was a s ever so slightly better than an onboard NIC for gaming because the onboard NICs are getting a lot better nowadays. So you have to keep that in mind. Now, also with, in terms of, um, it also has, a, I forgot to mention, it has a full diagnostics uh, sort of, application in the drivers itself. So this will test your cable. It'll actually test your cable. So your LAN cable and test how good it is. Mine came up with a good score and it actually accurately dete it detected like 25 meter cable. Even though I'm using a 15 meter cable, it detected that I had a long cable. So it also uh, has a self diagnostics to um, test the, the NIC itself to look for problems, which it found no problems. It also can test the transfer speeds, which it did. 
accurately. So it does a really good job if you guys are worried about, oh, something's wrong with my NRC. This thing has the ability to test itself, which is really good. I like that Intel um, deliver these full featured driver sets. So that's about it. I mean, it, it's a good product, it's well built, comes with a lifetime warranty. Um, it's PCI Express as well. It, it works flawlessly. It's a good product. I can highly recommend this. I will give it overall a four and a half stars. I just think the color uh, could use an update. I don't, I'm not particularly keen on the green PCB, uh, even though it's kind of like a graphite sort of look that they're going with here, but it is a good product. Anyways, if you have any questions about this product, please leave a comment in the comments section below. Um, if you haven't already, uh, please subscribe to Tech Air City. Well, I'll be coming back to you guys with more tech videos. So we'll get a close up of this uh, product here. Hopefully we can get a close up there. So there's what it looks like. And yeah, if that's about it guys, that's just the review. That's the Intel uh, CT desktop adapter. So uh, good product. Anyway guys, if you haven't already, you can check out my, I'll put the link in the description below where I put this head to head with the killer NIC from MSI or Qualcomm. And yeah, peace out for now. Brand easy. Bye.